Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will explain to you the 20 most important volleyball terms that you will need for your tryout or just in general when you're starting to play volleyball. Okay, let's jump right into it. Serve, the first contact of the ball that starts the play. The server sends the ball over the net from behind the end line. There are different kinds of serve. There's underhand, overhand, float, jump, top spins, pass, or serve receive. The first contact after the serve. Dig, the first contact after an attacker from the opposing team sends the ball over the net to the defensive team. Set, the second contact. This is when a setter sets the ball high up for a attacker to attack. Normally a set is made with two hands overhand, but there are times where people do it with their platform and it's called a bump set. Hit, attack, or spike. They're the same thing. It's the third contact. When a player hits the ball over the net, normally with a lot of force. Block. This contact is made when a player tries to stop the ball from coming over the net or try to slow down the ball from the attack. This contact does not count as one of the three contacts a team is allowed to make per play. The same player that blocks the ball may contact the ball again. Ace, a serve that cannot be returned by the opponent. Normally, it's because the serve is too powerful and the receiving team aren't strong enough to handle it. Kill, an attack that is unreturnable by the opposing team and it is also because it's too powerful. Rally, when the ball is in play. A dump or a setter attack. It's when the setter doesn't set the ball but instead they send it over the net. Pancake, when a player lands on the floor with their body trying to save the ball with an open hand on the floor and tries to let the ball bounce off their hand, it's called pancake. Free ball, when the opposing team doesn't attack, they just send the ball over the net underhand with a bump or set it over. Short, the area in front of you that you're covering. So when you say, I got short to your teammates, that means you got the area in front of you, so you're in charge of that area. And deep is the area that is behind you. The so same thing with short, when you say, I got deep, that means you are in charge of the area behind you. Shank, when you shank a ball, that means you try to receive the ball, but you couldn't so the ball just kind of bounced off your platform and go somewhere else and not an ideal receive straight when a hitter hits straight that means they hitting down straight like the line and when they hit cross court that means they're hitting it diagonally your platform it's where you receive a ball it has to be really strong so that you don't shank the ball save a save is when one of your teammates shank and he's tried to save the ball back in play that's a save or when you receive a really strong spike from the opponent that's also a save substitution it's the replacement of a player by one of your teammates and every game there's a limited substitution count which is 12 when liberos are switching on and off courts they are called libero entry and they do not count towards the substitutional count hitting error it's when a hitter an attacker or a psycho whatever you call it they're the same they hit the ball into the net or outside the court so that's an hitting error made by the hitter that's it for the video i hope it was helpful and thank you for watching bye